He's, he's yeah, over here now. That's a lot of cars. <laughs> All right. Well, let's uh, we'll call to order the uh, January 2018 Visual Resources Review Board meeting for the town of Farragut. So the first item on our agenda tonight is the approval of the minutes from November 2017, as we didn't have a meeting in December. Any comments or questions about the minutes from November? All right, do we have a motion? Motion to approve. We have a motion, do we have a second? Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? All right, looks like we had a couple of wall signs approved between the last meeting and tonight. Any, any questions or comments about those wall signs? No? One of them's in Renaissance, the, the art house, mm -hmm. kitchen and bath. And the other one, of course, is related to the, one of our signs tonight. Verizon's changing out their corporate logo a little bit. So. Okay. All right, well, let's move on then to the ground mounted sign applications. And um, we have a representative here from, for Christ's Covenant, so why don't we move forward to those two signs and tackle them first? Are you all here from Verizon, too? If you've got any questions about her, I went over it with Keith. I'm not terribly familiar with Oh, you're. It's you Sanco also. Yeah, they're, oh, they're all three. Oh, so yeah. oh I didn't realize. Well, we'll start at Verizon then. I didn't realize. Okay. I didn't see that on here that it said sign code, so. We're, uh, we're the yeah, right there. And the we're just doing the installed permit. Oh. Oh. All right, I missed that. Well, we'll start with Verizon then. It looks like they're changing, changing the face on the sign that's already existing. Yeah, it looks like they're going from a black, primarily back, black background to a gray. gray. <clears throat> um, and changing the check mark a little bit. To, um, so I'm taking out wireless as well. Um, the sign face is actually the same size as what's out there, and it's. I think their dimensions are off a little bit. Whatever they got from Elro Signs, that should be about 40 square feet is what's out there, and they're not. They're not changing that at all. They're not enlarging it. It's just basically replacing the face with the same size face. Um, it's very legible. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I would recommend approval. Uh, it looks like it's, I mean, the setbacks is like it's already there. So the area is landscaping around it. And uh, I don't have any really comments on this one. It looks pretty simple. Letters are large and yeah, probably easier to read from a letter size than yeah, the previous size. Yeah, I think it size. is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the Z, of course. I mean, because the red kind of took the. Yeah. I like it. All right. Any further comments? Okay. Do we have a motion? Motion to approve. All right. We have a motion to approve. Do we have a second? Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? All right. So now we'll move on to the Christ Covenant, the first Christ Covenant sign. <coughs> Yeah, this sign is replacing the existing sign, Kingston Pike. They're actually keeping the brick base. Uh, you can kind of see it there. Um, there's not any landscaping currently around the sign, and that apparently is a problem with <laughs> these signs get landscaped when they first put them in, but then we're finding that people take it out over time, so they'll be adding back landscaping. Um, to the sign, um, the uh, they would just since the setback is what it is, they're not going with a larger sign than what's out there. Um, the setback should be fine. Um, we'll just need to, you know, make sure that they do install the landscaping so that the sign is compliant. It looks like the height and everything is is compliant on the sign. They're uh, apparently just wanting to give it a little bit more modern look, mm -hmm. um, 
with the their... The Hollies are the only one that will be there all year, correct? The yeah, I think Barry be is, is evergreen. The Black mm -hmm. and High Susans will be seasonal. Yeah, and we talked mold. about the cardinal flower last time uh -huh. Pat was here. That might, I mean, normally that I like that plant, but it it's probably going to be one that would <coughs> need to be, it probably wouldn't be appropriate for being out there in the, in the sun and the heat. It's more of a wet. It's not going to last, I don't think. No, we talked about marigolds or something the last time with the Isarium sign. They're just some kind of more durable, preferably native plant out there would be would be probably fine. So, but it looks very legible. It it's a nice looking I sign. Like uh, the staff would recommend approval. Yep, it looks very legible. It's pretty. All right, do we have any other comments on it or questions? Okay. We have a motion to, or do we have a motion? <laughs> All right, we have a motion to approve. We have a second. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? All right, and the second Christ Covenant sign is around the corner. Yeah, they have two entrances <clears throat> in Christ Covenant. They have the Kingston Pike one, of course, and then they've got one off of uh, North Hobbs Road. And uh, they're wanting a smaller sign at that near that access point. This is be a new sign, so they would have to verify setbacks. And it's almost kind of like a directional sign, but it's bigger than what's allowed. It's a really small ground-mounted sign is really what it is. Um, they wouldn't need the address numbers on the top of this one <clears throat> since the since the property is, has a Kingston Pike address. It would be confusing if you. Right. put address numbers on that one um, so this one you know subject to verifying a setback which would only have to be 10 feet because it's so small um, the staff would recommend approval now there is some small lettering there it's two and a half inch on that PCA um, I don't know that that's I don't have a real concern with that um, I think the main part of the of the sign, what you're really needing to see, is probably yeah. large enough to. Yeah, and it'll to be read. closer to the street too, so that'll make it a little more easy to to see. Right. Um, but subject to you know coordinating the placement with the town staff and of course landscaping uh, staff would recommend approval. Okay. I think the sign itself is fine. I have a little bit of a problem. It looks like you took three gray blocks and just set something on top of it. Could that not be a little better? I think that might be that dimension that's... Mm -hmm. Is that what it, is? it looks like blocks? It's just you one just piece. It it's on just there. one solid piece. Okay. Yeah. Now, I mean, if you all want it to be a brick base, that's something you No, I mean, I about. think it would look nice if it was the same brick as on the front side, but, you know, as long as it's not just four big blocks sitting there. Well, typically it'd be hard to match brick, yeah. too, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. that other, it was already, a, okay. already there. So already I there, there yeah. I got you. Could you switch to that one just a moment? The other one, the first one, yeah. please? Oops, sorry. Huh. Well, so there's the gray. Yeah, there's yeah, the gray, there's so the gray there. Okay. Too, so. yeah. okay. Yeah, it's the same color of gray, so. So that's. So it's going to match the best they can, okay. can do it. And it looks like the landscaping is going to be about the same around it too. So. Yeah, it should be. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, is there any other comments or questions about this sign? Okay. Do we have a motion? I'll make a motion that we approve it as it is. All right, subject to those couple subject of... Subject to the setbacks. All right, we have a motion. Do we have a second? Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Okay. Thank you, Pat. Thank you. That's, uh, that was sweet. That's well, everything short, on the agenda. Well, short and sweet. I hated to even have a meeting. It was such a minimal. <laughs> but I think they needed some <clears throat> direction, and we didn't have a meeting last month. So. Right. Thank you. I may, if it's okay with you all, just <clears throat> if it's a really small agenda like that, just 
just send your packets like I did this month, just electronic because oh, it's it's really yeah, actually that's fine. unless it's a huge one. Yeah, yeah I it's mean if perfect. it's a big one or has a landscape something in there that you need. It's a lot easier you for know. you and. I did that with the Board of Zoning Appeals, too, because their packet was real small this month, and they've got a meeting tomorrow night. But uh, if it's, I mean, it's just, you know, I didn't. I